Well, hello everybody and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. I have two books here. They are by Destiny Lauritsen, I believe is how you pronounce it. One is, mm, excuse me, Under the Sea Where Mermaids Be. <laughs> and the other one is A Fairy Lives in Every Garden. So let's take a look at the mermaids. This is the front cover and the back cover. You can see a few images from inside the book. It says features wide margins for easier framing, varied complexity for all ages and skill levels, single-sided images to prevent bleed through. There are 25 pages in this book. So let's have a look. Okay, it says, I'm so glad this book of mermaids has found you, and I hope it brings hours of imaginative fun your way. And then talks about color schemes and media that would work in here. She does have a website, destinylauritsen.com. Not quite sure if this is a person or a company. So, so many of them now sounds like a person's name, and it's not. It's a company. So, it is Destiny Lauritsen Illustration and Design. So, and we get into the book itself. Isn't that cute? Ah, she's a jellyfish. That is adorable. Can you hear me now? <laughs> Oh my, how are them staying up? <laughs> the world shall never know. And she's hiding. Do they have super glue underneath the sea? <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, she's <isn't> cute. <laughs> Oh my. <laughs> okay. She is surrounded by skeletons. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> it's a happy porpoise. Purpose. Porpoise. <laughs> or dolphin. I never know the difference. Twinkle, twinkle, little starfish. <laughs> Even the seagulls singing. Oh, I like that. That is cute. Adventure on the horizon. That's cute, too. <laughs> They're all cute. Tell my hands are dry. <laughs> I can't get the pages apart. Aww. <laughs> the seals are also happy. <laughs> Siren's song. All right, and that is the end of that book. And again, Under the Sea Where Mermaids Be. So let's take a look at A Fairy Lives in Every Garden. This is the front cover and the back cover. Again, there are 25 images in here of adorable fairies and beautiful floral backgrounds. All right. Talks about the same thing as the first book. There is the title page, and then we get right into the book. <laughs> oh. As you all know, I love fairies. 
Now these you could color in or not. You know, you could just put maybe a watered down acrylic paint or watercolor medium. Neo color twos or something. Nice autumn picture. Ah, oh, isn't that cute? Love it. Love it. They're in frames. Oh, so cute. I do love the floral backgrounds. That's a little fairy. So for me, this is the best of both worlds because I love fairies and I love flowers. I know, I know. You love them, but you don't color them. I know, I gotta get my pencils out. Although, this is single-sided. You can just straight color them. And I have to keep telling you, so that. I mean, you can even straight color with pencil, and I just, I can't make myself do it. I always think I gotta shade and blend. And, but these are absolutely uh Adorable. I will link them both down below in the description. They are Amazon affiliate links, so if you do purchase the books or anything else while you're over on Amazon, I do get credit for that, and I get a little bit of kickback that goes back into the channel, so I do appreciate it when you use the link. <laughs> all right and that is the end of that one again a fairy lives in every garden so again these are two books by destiny floritson thank you so much for watching this video i hope you enjoyed the flip throughs if you did please hit that thumbs up button subscribe if you're new to my channel i hope everybody's having a great day and as always, happy coloring. Bye, guys.